Hey guys, this is the 11th video in our calculation trick series. And in this video, I am going to tell you how to calculate the square of a number which is close to 100. Okay. And uh, how much close is purely dependent upon your knowledge of how much you know about squares of the number from 1 to the number which you know. Okay. So let's start with our first question, which is. Can you calculate the square of 106 in just 2 seconds? Well, it is of course impossible for anyone to calculate with the traditional ways the square of 106 in 2 seconds. So, let's go on our... Uh, sorry. Let's go to the trick and see what can be done. So, we have the number which is... Uh, 106 okay and we have to calculate the square of this number and uh, in this number we are taking 100 as a base so what we would do is first of all we see how much this number and 100 have the difference means what is the difference between this number and 100 okay the difference is of plus 6 okay since the this difference is of plus 6, what we would do is just we double 6 means 2 into 6 is 12 and we add 12 and 10 and we will write 1, 1, 2 means 1 then 12 the double of 6 and then square of 6 okay square of 6 is 36 and done this is our answer simple isn't it? And what if the difference is minus 6? Means let's say I have the number which is not 106. Let's say I have the number which is 94. And we want to calculate the square. And in here the difference is minus 6. Okay. So what, what would be it like that the answer is not this. What we will do? We have 100. And we are actually adding the double of 6 in 100. We do the same. We add double of minus 6 in 100. Okay. Double of minus 6 is minus 12. Adding 100 and minus 12 will give us 88. Okay. You got it? 88. Because we are actually subtracting 12 from 100. So 88. Okay. And after that, you write square of 6, which is 36. This is our answer. Simple. Is that it? So let's try another example and see what can be done. Okay, so let me take a number like uh, uh, 108. 108. Okay, and we want to calculate the square of this number. So, what will we do? First step we have 100, we would add double of 8 in 100. So, double of 8 is 16. 100 plus 16 is 116. Okay. And then we write square of 8, which is 64. So the answer is 11664. Easy. Let's take it as an example. Uh, let's say we have the number 111 and we want to calculate the square. Okay. What would we do? We have 11 difference. So we add 11 in 100. Double of 11 in 100, which is 22. So we have 122. Okay. And what would you do after that? Square of 11 is 121. So we would write because we have only two spaces here. We would carry 1, then 2, then 1. Okay. So our answer is 1, 2, 3, 2, 1. Simple. Blend it. And we will do the same if we have the number which is less than 100. Like, uh, let's say we have the number uh, 95. And we have to calculate the square of 95. What we will we do is we have a difference 5. So we subtract double of 5. Or we can just subtract. Uh, 5 from this whole number that 
will be the same from subtracting 100 from double of 5 from 100. So we would subtract 5 from 95 and it will give 90. Okay. And then we write square of 25 here. Square of 5, that is 25. And this is our answer. Simple. And the same we would do for, let's say we have a number which is 87. Okay. So the difference is 13. We would subtract 13 from here. That would be the same. That would be the same from subtracting double of 13 and 100. So we subtract 13 from 87 itself. So 7 minus 3, that is 4, and 8 minus 1, that is 7. Okay. 25 here. We have two places. Now square of 13 is 169. So we carry 169, and the answer is 9657. So the answer is 7569. Simple. And I think you understood this. So enjoy. And uh, let's end our session here.